What are the symptoms of spiritual fatigue? What causes it? The mind becomes overactive during a spiritual fatigue. It starts thinking that I have achieved something. This sense of achievement derails the whole thing. To put it in Lalaji's style, you know, Lalaji says, a knowledgeable person, he thinks that I have knowledge. And because of this awareness that he has knowledge, he tends to learn lesser and lesser. Similarly, on the same note, when a person with a sense of achievement continues on this way of thinking that I have achieved, this had seen a kind of a blockade, you know, and we, we are somehow, I think, disadvantaged by our own understanding of achievements. Is it because of samskars? In which category shall we put this fatigue arising in, in, in our spiritual journey? When you ponder over this, it comes to one basic thing, misunderstanding. That's why we keep on praying, may there be right understanding correct thinking and right understanding. When I understand situations correctly, I tend to form the right opinion about things. And because of these right opinions, you will not form impressions. When you have already worn the glasses of misunderstanding, you will see only through this misunderstood vision. So we have to filter this, I, this, we have to insert this filter of understanding in our mechanism, mental mechanism, before concluding things, ensure that you are concluding with the right understanding. With the wrong understanding, we tend to form deeper impressions. Nobody forms impressions as deep when you think and understand correctly. So we have to develop this higher level of understanding of every little situation. Mm -hmm.